Hey everyone! Welcome back to 2230, where we dive into fascinating stories and share our thoughts on the latest happenings. Today, we've got an intriguing journey to discuss, one that defies conventional expectations. Before we jump in, don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button for more engaging content. Now, let's get started. Meet Matthew Tay, a 24-year-old from Hugang, Singapore, who chose to follow his heart and pursue a lifelong passion for buses instead of enrolling in one of the top universities. Imagine turning down offers from prestigious institutions like Singapore Management University, National University of Singapore, and Nanyang Technological University. It's a decision that took many by surprise, but for Matthew, it's a dream come true. Growing up near a now-defunct bus interchange, Matthew's fascination with buses started early. His parents fueled his interest by taking him to various bus interchanges, sparking a collection of brochures and drawings. By the age of 12, he was already a member of the Singapore Bus Enthusiasts Facebook group, setting the stage for bus spotting adventures across Singapore. But Matthew's passion didn't stop at observation. He began collecting bus models from around the world, investing over 2,000 Singapore dollars in his impressive collection. From seats to electronic displays and even a restored bus dashboard, Matthew's dedication to his passion knows no bounds. Despite being a top-scoring student with a near-perfect GPA, Matthew shocked everyone by choosing a different path. While serving in Singapore's national service, he spent weekends learning to drive buses and obtained a bus driving license. In 2022, he joined Tower Transit Singapore as an operations supervisor, managing day-to-day -day operations and ensuring buses run on schedule. Matthew challenges stereotypes about working in the bus industry, emphasizing the social aspect of his job and debunking the misconception that it's a dead-end career. In his TikTok account, Matthew gives us a glimpse into his daily life, managing operations in what he calls the largest bus interchange in Singapore. From the bustling environment to chances for physical activity and unexpected discoveries like a jackfruit tree, he paints a vivid picture of his fulfilling job. Despite societal pressure to pursue higher education, Matthew finds satisfaction and purpose in his role. He emphasizes that he's comfortable with his salary, lives with his parents, and doesn't feel financial pressure. Online commentators have shown overwhelming support for Matthew's unconventional choice. They applaud his dedication to serving bus passengers in Singapore and doing what he loves. Some even playfully dub him the most famous bus driver in Singapore due to the widespread coverage of his story. As we wrap up this intriguing journey, Let's show our support for Matthew by leaving positive comments down below. What do you think about his unconventional choice? Would you have made a similar decision? Share your thoughts, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more inspiring stories here on 2230. Until next time, stay curious.